this is uh, Petra Michel Michels from uh, Vincot OK Compost, a company which uh, uh, certifies uh, if um, packaging is compostable or not. And uh, Petra, can you tell me something about what you do? Yeah, we um, certify products for being compostable. So uh, depending on what type of products, we have to perform uh, mainly four type of tests. There's a biodegradation test, disintegration mm -hmm. test, Disintegration means physically falling apart, ecotoxicity testing, and uh, heavy metal testing. And when we have the test results of this test, we uh, interpret the results, and then if they're positive, we can, as an independent company, prove that your product is compostable, or that the product is compostable, and then we issue the certificate OK Compost, and, uh, which you can see here. Yes. OK Compost. Mm -hmm. And this logo can then be put on the product. Yes. That's the main, uh, the main idea of what you do. Okay, so can you show some products here which you have um, certified as being compostable? Yeah, of course. We have uh, different products. So it all started in uh, the 80s already with uh, biodegradable uh, bags for biorefuse, which you can see over there. That, that, that's the 1980s, so this is now 20 years old. Yeah, no, yeah. but of course the product evolved. It wasn't oh like yeah, it that wasn't at as good. the time. Yeah, sure. where, but uh, the products evolved a lot because at that time sometimes there were problems with strength, but now this is all resolved. So this and this and this are the bags for uh, biodegradable refuse. But yes. also the typical example is also the shopping bags. You can see different examples mm -hmm. like this. Yeah. Or also Fnac. This one, yeah. Fnac is a famous shop. Oh yes. And also uh, this is uh, a foil to put around fresh herbs in pots, so you can see basilicum. Yes. Just put around the pot. It's, it's made of PLA. Yes. But also um, more evolved products like uh, different kind of trays for cookies, for uh, fruits. Yeah. This is uh, for hot cups. Yes. Or for meat. Yeah. And then even more uh, evolved are the the labels. They're yeah. there with, with glue. Yeah. But uh, the, the percentage of glue is very low, of course. Yeah. So this uh, kind of labels already look quite... Uh, they, they don't look uh, like the original products and you don't feel it anymore that they're compostable so they have the, they have the same uh, look and feel as uh, normal products yeah and uh, this is these are the products that we have for uh, okay compostable mm -hmm. uh, okay compost but uh, we also have different labels which is okay biodegradable mm -hmm. i can uh, show it here yeah there are two additional uh, labels, OK biodegradable in the soil and OK biodegradable in the water. Yes. So we, ha we always have to define the environment where a product is biodegradable in. And for soil, we have some good examples also here, which are the plant pots that you can see over there. Yeah. Um, so the plant pots, they have a, this is a plastic feel and this is more a fiber feel. Yeah. Um, and these you can just put them in the ground and leave them there, they will uh, biodegrade after a And, and the plant time. will grow normally so you don't have yes. to transplant yes. the plant. Also a good example is the, the mulching film, yes. uh, which can be applied to the soil and then after use will be ploughed in the soil yes. and then just uh, biodegrade um, on the spot. Okay, very good. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome.